When did all this start, Daniel? Hey there, welcome back to Director's Choice. Today, we are going to talk about one of the most iconic and beloved characters in the history of animation, Velma Dinkley. You like solving mysteries? Uh, yeah, but I'm actually much more three-dimensional than that. Velma has been a part of our lives for over 50 years, and she has become a cultural icon, inspiring generations of fans around the world. In this video, we will take a deep dive into Velma's journey from her early days in the original Scooby-Doo series to her latest adventure in the HBO Max series Velma. Uh, unknown caller. We will explore her most memorable moments, her strengths, her contributions to the world of animation, and the impact she has had on popular culture. Velma Dinkley, one of the most iconic characters in the history of animation, was first introduced to the world in 1969 in the original series Scooby-Doo. Where are you? She was part of the gang that included Fred, Daphne, Shaggy, and, of course, Scooby-Doo. From the very beginning, Velma stood out as a unique and interesting character. She was depicted as an intelligent and analytical person, always ready to solve the mysteries that the gang encountered. She was also known for her sharp wit, sarcasm, and her iconic orange turtleneck sweater. One of Velma's most memorable moments from the early days of the series was in the episode What a Night for a Night. In this episode, the gang was investigating a haunted suit of armor when Velma lost her glasses, leading to a hilarious sequence of events where she accidentally grabbed the wrong objects, mistaking them for her glasses. In a clue for Scooby-Doo, Velma's intelligence and problem-solving skills were on full display as she deduced the identity of the villain by analyzing the clues left behind at the crime scene. This episode highlights Velma's importance to the gang and her ability to solve even the most complicated mysteries. Perhaps one of Velma's most well-known moments is when she loses her glasses. My glasses! This has happened in several episodes, leading to a series of comedic mishaps as she tries to grab the right object to replace them with. In Jeepers, it's the Creeper, Velma shows off her physical strength as she manages to fight off the villain, the Creeper, with a karate chop. This moment highlights Velma's strength and independence, showing that she is more than just a smart person. She can also hold her own in a fight. In Scooby-Doo, Music of the Vampire, Velma shows off her musical talents by singing a rendition of Patsy Cline's I Fall to Pieces. This moment showcases Velma's versatility as a character and adds an extra layer of depth to her personality. Most recently, in the HBO Max series Velma, the character is reimagined as a young woman haunted by the mysterious death of her mother. This series explores Velma's character in a deeper and more complex way and showcases her strength and intelligence as she investigates her mother's death and uncovers a web of secrets and conspiracies surrounding her family and the town of Crystal Cove. Velma's most memorable moments highlight her intelligence, strength, and wit. Whether she's losing her glasses in the middle of a mystery, solving a puzzle that has stumped the rest of the gang, fighting off a villain with a karate chop, singing a beautiful song, or investigating her mother's death, Velma always manages to stand out as a unique and interesting character. Velma's intelligence and analytical skills were her biggest strengths, and they became essential to the gang's success in solving mysteries. She was always the first to spot clues, and she used her sharp mind to solve puzzles and decipher codes. However, Velma was more than just a smart person. She was also a strong and independent woman who was not afraid to speak her mind and stand up for what she believed in. She was a feminist icon long before the term became popular, and she inspired generations of girls to embrace their intelligence and independence. Velma was also a loyal friend who cared deeply about her friends, especially her best friend, Daphne. Despite their differences, Velma and Daphne had a close bond that was based on mutual respect and admiration. Over the years, Velma has been featured in numerous adaptations of the Scooby-Doo franchise, including television shows, movies, and video games. In recent years, she has also become the subject of fan theory and speculation, particularly regarding her relationship with Daphne. That's depressing. Yes, it is. But what can you do? In 2021, a new animated series called Velma was released on HBO Max, which is centered around Velma as the main character. This series reimagines the character's backstory and personality in a different way from the original Scooby-Doo series. In the Velma series, Velma is portrayed as a smart, sarcastic, 
and fiercely independent young woman who is haunted by the mysterious death of her mother. The show follows Velma as she investigates her mother's death and uncovers a web of secrets and conspiracies surrounding her family and the town of Crystal Cove. This new version of Velma has been met with both praise and criticism from fans. Some appreciate the new direction the character has taken and the chance to explore her character in a new and deeper way, while others feel that it strays too far from the original Scooby-Doo series. Despite the mixed reception, the Velma series is a testament to the enduring popularity and relevance of the character. Velma has always been a symbol of intelligence, independence, and strength, and this new series builds on those qualities in new and exciting ways. Velma Dinkley's impact on popular culture cannot be overstated. She has been an inspiration to countless fans, particularly girls and young women, who have looked up to her as a role model and a feminist icon. Her intelligence and analytical skills have challenged traditional gender roles and helped to break down stereotypes, showing that girls can be just as capable and strong as boys. Velma has also had a significant impact on the world of animation. Her character has been a constant presence in the Scooby-Doo franchise, and she has inspired countless other animated characters who share her intelligence, wit, and strength. Her iconic orange turtleneck sweater has become a symbol of her character, and it is instantly recognizable to fans around the world. In conclusion, Velma Dinkley is one of the most iconic and beloved characters in the history of animation. Her intelligence, sharp wit, and independent spirit have made her a role model for generations of fans around the world. From her early days in the original Scooby-Doo series to her latest adventure in the HBO Max series Velma, she has remained a constant presence in the world of animation, inspiring and entertaining audiences of all ages. Whether she's solving mysteries with the Scooby-Doo gang or investigating the death of her mother in the HBO Max series Velma, Velma remains a beloved and essential part of popular culture. We can't wait to see where her adventures take her next. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the memorable moments of Velma Dinkley, one of the most iconic and beloved characters in the history of animation. From her early days in the original Scooby-Doo series to her latest adventure in the HBO Max series Velma, Velma has remained a constant presence in our lives, inspiring and entertaining generations of fans around the world. She is a symbol of strength and empowerment for all of us. So, whether you're a longtime fan of the Scooby-Doo franchise or a newcomer to the world of Velma Dinkley, I hope that this video has given you a new appreciation for this iconic character and all that she represents. Thank you for watching Director's Choice, and until next time, keep solving those mysteries.